Okay, thank you. Thank you, Robin. Uh, I have so I have um I have a question I asked you personally, so we're asking on the on, on here. So okay. Gonna ask you. Yeah, go go ahead. I don't know. It's if it's about one letter, well, why this letter or that letter? I would I would not know. I mean, need to do like uh, see the matters. But uh, another question. What was it, please? It was. Yeah, uh, it was it was two questions. It's like about the same. So, so the Ramban says about this week's parsha that the reason why the Ammonites and the Moabites specifically. Or the, um, yeah, right. They're mm -hmm. specifically chosen out to be like, uh, like never part of the Jewish, like the male. Right? It's because specifically the males of each, like didn't do, like they, they didn't help the Jews. The Moabites had been uh, Bilam and the Ammonites. Um, they didn't feed. They're they're the ones who are supposed to feed the Jews, and they didn't like on their way. Mm -hmm. And then and then on like a night, and then then the, the next two Sukimar talks about the Mitzrayim and the Edomim. Right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It says that um, it says uh, like Ramban says in that that the reason why the Mitzrayim and the Edomim they weren't punished as badly is because they only did physical damage, but the but the Amo, the Amonim and the Moabim they did spiritual damage. Mm -hmm. But you know my question is, mm -hmm. so my question about the first Ramban is that um he's like. Why? Why were the Moabite women punished? Because they—they're the ones who did the act. They're also the Midianite women. They, they did like the actual act of the of co uh, cohabitation with the mm -hmm. Jews. And um, uh, and then for the Ramban after, right? The so first of all, we're in the one one sorry, one sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, you, 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 you mix it. You, you already like, put like five questions in front of us. Let's do one one at a time. Please, uh, I, I cannot remember all of this question. I apologize. So let's uh, let's do uh, the, the, the the one. Um, uh, I, I think we'll, let's start with with the last one because it's it actually comes uh, first in a in a sequence. So, so why why the uh, women right? So why men was punished? Uh, this uh, um, Amon and Moab right? Why? Because uh, because Moab uh, Amon and Moab actually came from who? From Lot. From Lot's uh, relations with two sisters, right? Came came these two nations, and uh, Lot was actually alive, right? He he survived from uh, from this uh, uh, destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah because of Abraham, not because he was holy. He was uh, the, the the lowest. I mean, he was a little better than uh, the, the rest of the city, but still, if, uh, the whole city has been the uh, like uh, destroyed, all of the people get it destroyed. If his little holy is not going to help him, right? Uh, he, he decided to be there because he likes the rules. He he liked the people, right? Uh, we have to remember that, all right? So they, they were they, they were actually in this world because of the Abraham. So at least be decent. And when uh, when uh, the um, uh, the descendants of Abraham. Right, who actually save you and because because of whom you you exist and your nation exists but they went out of egypt so bring them uh, bread and water the, the question is did we need the bread and water absolutely not we did not need their bread and we did not did not need their water why because we have mana right at that time and we have well of medium fresh water we don't need your stale water but uh, these people uh, they will try to make a fun of us and if you if you read the uh, Talmud, and actually it's from from um, the Russian as well, so they they br uh, brought something salty, right? Some salty food, or maybe it was cheese or something salty, salty fish or something, right? Uh, to, uh, to eat, and uh, they put like uh, these uh, con containers, like uh, like I don't know what was it called, like uh, the skins, right? Uh, and uh, in 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 the skin you pour water. Right, and uh, they actually did not pour water, but they poured like hot air. So after you, you, you like it, it's hot, and you ate salty food, and you want to drink, and it's hot air. So some people actually died, or like it was a like a very big, big insult. Right, we did not need the, the, their food, but Torah says so. So you, if you go through the through the somebody's uh, uh, land, you you stay in somebody's house. So you have to be appreciative. You have to buy food. You have to like to do something for your host. So that, that's why uh, our, our nation said, okay, we're going through, through your land, we're going to pay you. Do, 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 do we need your water? Absolutely not. Do we need your food? Absolutely not. But uh, to be nice, to be polite, to, to be cordial, so you have to pay to, the, to these nations. But these people, they make fun of us, 
right? Uh, but um, of course, it's not appropriate for a woman to go out and, and greet strangers. So women, she is not allowed to uh, um, the, to go like uh, to greet strangers. Absolutely not. So women stayed home, and it was men who did not go, uh, according to one opinion, but according to second, some of them went and did uh, they made the, this uh, practical joke on us, played a pretty practical joke. Okay, so so that's why men was pun were punished because they were very ungrateful, right? And uh, a definition of a Jew is to be grateful, right? Modem, it's uh, modem, it's, uh, it's meaning uh, thank you, right? So and we actually when we pray Ashmanesa, we uh, bow and then this, right? So definition of Jew is to be grateful, and these people they are not grateful. If they have a nature like that and being ungrateful in their in their blood, so they, they cannot be a Jew. I mean, uh, uh, just because a person knows material, uh, he, he learned all of the halachas, all of this aspect of Judaism, does not mean that uh, he has a char character that is to be a Jew. You understand? That, that's, uh, but women, they, they had no fault. And that's why uh, the halacha was that uh, uh, Moavia, but not, uh, not, not, uh, um, not, uh, not the man, right? And uh, from, um, uh, from Amon, a woman from Amon, but not, uh, not the man. That's it. And so, and uh, this is actually the Ruth. She was. She came from Moab, right? And second uh, lady is uh, uh, name started with from N. I don't remember what it was the name. So, but but she was one of the wives of uh, Shlomo Hamelach. Nama. I don't. I don't remember the, the the name, but but she she was a holy convert also. So Hashem actually kept these two nations because uh, because of the two the, the, these two pre precious uh, ladies that are going to one time many many hundreds of years ago come come from this nation so it's worth it for Hashem to, to, to preserve the whole nation because of this and uh, not to kill that's why he said don't go into war with Moab with Ammon just leave them alone so I mean uh, kill them a little but uh, but not too much mm -hmm.